Lewis, you're getting your first start of the season against Bristol this Sunday. Uh, how excited are you for that? I can't wait. I can't wait. It's been uh, four weeks of the season. I've now got my chance, so uh, it's time to take it. It's such a big stage as well. It's, uh, I'm lucky that it's been played on, on Sky Sports on the weekend and uh, it's such a tough challenge as well in Bristol. So, no, really, really looking forward to it. Yeah, uh, the coaches have obviously been pleased with what they've been seeing from the bench. Have you had any particular goals when you've, uh, when you've been coming on as a substitute? Um, not really, because on the bench you, you do cover a lot of positions, so you need to expect to go to be put on anywhere on the field. I mean, I, could, I, I was covering back three, centres, yeah. ten, uh, maybe not nine, but uh, no, you've got to be uh, prepared to play any position. So I've just been coming on the field, trying to do as best I can um, where, I've, where I've been put on the field. So no, just no real goals, just been playing as, as well as I can. Yeah, uh, your versatility is obviously uh, quite a strength of yours, but you're starting at 12 alongside Piers O'Connor at 13. That's uh, an exciting combination on Sunday, isn't it? Definitely, definitely. I mean, we've all seen what Piers can do. He's He's on great form at the moment, and I'm very much looking forward to playing with him as well. Um, I'm, I pride myself on my distribution and, and ball playing skills, so hopefully I can uh, I can help him out and put him in a few different holes as well. Yep, um, Joe Munro is obviously quite a big carrot, uh, big ball carrying twelve. Uh, what would you say your particular strengths are in that area? Um, I mean, I, I can ball carry, and I've, my distribution skills. I've also got a right foot as well, so I mean. I've maybe not got one um, real standout strength, but I cover. I like to think I cover all bases. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, a great win last weekend. What's the mood been like in camp this week, and uh, how's the training been? Oh, great! It's been. Uh, we've had a good week so far. Uh, obviously, what, we've got team run now tomorrow, but uh, it's been intense. Um, we know what we to expect on the weekend in Bristol. They play an expansive game. Obviously, the coaches come from Connaught. When Connaught won the league, they were throwing the ball around and, yeah. and really playing an expansive game of rugby. So. We need, we need to be really prepared to, to work extremely hard. Uh, they're not going to stop attacking all game, so I mean, the focus has been relentless defence and, and make sure we look after what we do in attack as well. Yeah, uh, I'm sure we prepare for each game kind of uh, the same, but does this one feel a bit different being such a, such a big one? We all know it's a big game. Um, the prep's been the same. I mean, we prep in the, the same way every single yeah. week. Um, but no, maybe in the back of our minds because the game's on Sky as well. I know it was on Sky last week, so maybe there's that extra edge. But I mean, we're going to treat it like any other week and go out and focus on us and uh, really go out and perform. Yeah, well, obviously it's four bonus point wins out of four, 23 tries in those four games. So I guess we go there with a huge amount of confidence and, and no fear and just to, just to play as we have been for the last four games, basically. That's it, mate. I haven't really got anything to add to that. Go out there, play with no fear and really look to enjoy what we're doing. All the best this weekend.